Hey everyone, welcome back. So in this tutorial, what we're going to cover is how to add some features to our basic window that we created in the previous tutorial. So what I'm going to do in this video is create an application where I have an, a button and that button has some functionality. So here you can see the window that says to learn WX Python, click the link below. And when I click the link or the, or the button, it directs me to the WX uh, documentation page. So I'm going to show you how to implement that to your program. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to start out with um, our basic classes. So I have a class for my app, my frame, and my panel. And what you can see is that uh, there's some st stuff on here that I need to fill in. So the first thing is that I'm going to create a button and that button's actually going to open up a web browser. So I need to import a library called web browser. And I'm going to add the button to the panel. So here I'm going to say button equals wx button. And that button takes a couple of arguments. The first one is the parent. The parent will be the panel since the button's going to lay on the panel. Label should be uh, click here. The next thing is uh, we need to position the button. So I'm going to place that at 20 by 80. And I need to add some actions. So here I'm defining a new function under my panel and that is called on submit. So when the button is clicked, it's going to call on this function on submit and what this button or what this action is going to do is it's going to open up a web browser and I just need to add a link on there. So I'm going to paste on here the WX Python documentation page. So now that we have a function with an action, we need to bind that action to the button itself. So I'm going to say button bind event wx evt and button. So I'm saying that the event is related to a button event. And the handler will be this function called on submit. So self on submit. Great. So now when somebody clicks on this button, it's going to call this function, which will open up a web browser. The last thing to do is to add the panel to the frame. And remember, the frame is just the main window that the user is going to see. So we need to call panel equals uh, my panel. My panel takes an argument that parent self. And one more thing, uh, so we have class for the application, and so I need to add the uh, frame to the application. So frame equals my frame, parent none, title, it will should be uh, my button app, and position, let's place it at 100 by 100. Great, so I think that is all that we need to run our application. So I'm gonna grab a terminal now and launch this application. Okay, so I'm running the program, but you can see that nothing's showing up. So I'm gonna cancel that and I'm going to inspect the application. So here I'm saying calling frame, but one thing that I believe I forgot to do is say frame.show because we want to see the, uh, the frame. We don't want an application running in the background with nothing to see. So let's try running that program once again. Great, now we have our window and you can see it's placed at 100 by 100. And we have our button that's relatively placed to this text. I'm um, click the button and hopefully everything will direct me to the uh, 
the correct uh, web browser page, and it does. So it takes me to this WX API documentation page, and now I can read all the documentation that I want to read. So that's it. That's how to create an application and add a button to it that has some action.